At the Ohio University Airport on Saturday, over 100 people gathered to watch the International Space University's rocket launch competition. Several international teams came together to show off their aerospace engineering skills on a small scale. Their challenge? Design a rocket that flies over 1,000 feet and deploys a small parachute that will deliver an egg safely to the ground. The first launch reached an impressive height, but landed on the wrong side of the safety line. The third rocket launch didn't exactly go as planned. The landing was a little bit too close for comfort. After that, an expanded safety area made sure that nobody came into the line of fire. But launch number four was flawless. The parachute deployed and the egg landed, intact, near the runway. The event was capped off by two special launches. The faculty rocket was built by Space Studies program organizers and laser etched with the Ohio University and ISU's logos. It was designed to be large and loud. <laughs> the final launch was relatively small, but featured a launch pad modeled after Space Studies Program's poster with Stalker Center's cupola as the rocket. Before the final launch, Space Studies Program Director John Connolly took a moment to thank OU. Um, I'd personally like to thank everybody from Ohio University who has been our host, uh, who has who's sponsored International Space University this year, and who has so graciously uh, allowed us to use their airport today for a little fun. Then, after some electrical issues, Stalker Center flew. In the end, everyone was a winner at the rocket launch, except for a few cracked eggs. For WOUB News, I'm Ben Polstowicz.